Southern Regional Education Board offers a program called Academic Common Market, also known as ACM. And ACM offers in-state tuition to out-of-state residents within the Southern Region if their major is not offered in their state. That's the only way you'll qualify for this program. If this is something you're interested in applying for, go to sreb.org. Under Programs and Services, click on Academic Common Market. Out-of-state residents pay anywhere between two to three times the amount of in-state resident tuition. There are some steps. So the first step to qualify, and I'll walk you through the process, you must be a resident of one of the 15 participating states. Now, unfortunately, Texas and Florida only offers ACM for graduate studies, so that's the master's degree and above. Um, bachelor is not offered. North Carolina no longer participates in the program. So for demo purposes, I'll be a resident of Georgia. Select a program. It must be an eligible program in your home state. So we'll click on the link, search for programs. Choose your state. I'll be selecting Georgia. Degree level, bachelor's. State, if there's a specific state you wish to attend college at, select that state. We'll choose, for example, Louisiana. It'll populate institutions that offers the discount tuition program. But I'll be choosing all states and all institutions because I would like to keep my options open. For my major, I'll be selecting bioengineering and biomedical engineering because it's out of my league. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Not really. Okay, so traditional online. Traditional is on-campus classes. And online, of course, is taking classes online on the internet. I'll be selecting both. Click on search. Results. I have four results. University of Mississippi, University of Tennessee, University of Alabama, and Alabama State. I'll be selecting Ole Miss. So you click on the website and apply. You must be admitted into the university in order to be accepted into the ACM program. So apply like a regular student um, through the application process and also financial aid because although you'll be receiving in-state tuition rate, you also want to receive financial aid if you qualify. So the next step, you must receive your acceptance letter from the university and click on this link here, your state's ACM coordinator, because you have to verify that you are a resident of your home state. So click on that link, see ACM state contacts. Okay, I'll be selecting Georgia. And this is Georgia's ACM coordinator. The contact phone number, there's an email you can contact the coordinator or you can email them directly through the website. And you'll just be contacting them asking how do you uh, become certified as a resident of your home state and how do you apply for the program. Every state is different. They may request that you submit an application. And to get certified as a resident of your state, they may request for a driver's license, your state income taxes, and once you submit all that information in, your state coordinator will be the one to approve the application. Once your coordinator approves the application, which takes about four to six weeks for processing, and if you have any questions and you, you want to request for the status of your application, you will contact your coordinator. If that's approved, you are now accepted into the program. You do not need to reapply as long as you do not move out of your state as long as you do not leave the institution or the college or university that you're accepted into and you do not change majors. If you have any questions, contact the ACM coordinator.